Hey world of YouTubers, I'm KP, and thank you for stopping by my channel. Um, today I'm so excited to be doing uh, my first tag video, which is called the Sun Kissed Summer Tag. So Sun Kissed Summer Tag. I was tagged by, I don't know exactly, her name is Courtney, and it's Burks and Bees, and I'll leave her link below to all her information if you want to check her out. So hey Court, thank you so much for tagging me. Um, I'm excited to be doing this tag. It's 15 questions, and I will go ahead and get started. Um, the first question is, when did slash do you get out of school? And I graduated from school in 2001, so a very long time ago. But I do have a son who is six, and he just graduated first grade on May 23rd. So he's been out of school for a couple of weeks now, and we have just been nonstop enjoying the pretty weather. So the second question is beaches or pools, and we lived in Hawaii for three and a half years, which if you've watched my channel, you've known I've mentioned that a million times because it was really the best experience of our lives. But um, beaches, I'd prefer, but um, I don't live close to a beach anymore. We live in Oklahoma, so pools right now. Um, we've went to the pool a couple of times this, uh, this spring, not even summer yet, already. Um, number three, are you going on any summer vacations? If not, what's your dream vacation? We're kind of going on a summer vacation. We're going to visit family down in Texas in a few weeks. Um, so, hey guys, we'll see you in a couple of weeks. And we're super excited to be going down there to see them. They live on the outside of Dallas and there's a really big shopping mall down in Dallas that has a uh, ice skating rink and everything in it that I love to go to. Um, but it says, what is your dream summer vacation? I've had my dream summer vacation already. Um, uh, it was summertime for three and a half years for me in Hawaii. Like I said, so blessed I got to have done that for so long. Um, number four, s'mores or ice cream? Um, this one's really funny because when I saw it, I laughed because I prefer s'mores. But when I do get ice cream, I get, uh, like say we go to Cold Stone because they, they mix it and put it in there for you. We always get like the sweet cream vanilla um, ice cream and we put chocolate chips marshmallows and graham crackers in it with a little bit of uh syrup and that is so that is so funny that that was one of the questions so definitely s'mores um number five what's your most fun summer summer memory and it would have to be snorkeling in hawaii that um getting to snorkel with sea turtles and just there are so many different types of fish and it was just so amazing and just you know something that you only dream about getting to do so um six does your skin tan or burn um both i can get really tan if i want to and then sometimes i can get red but it never i always wear sunscreen when i go out so um but yeah most of the time if i get a little bit of a sunburn it turns into a nice tan um seven how do you wear your hair in the summer and I wear it up most of the time during the summer. Today we went to church, so I had my hair down. And um, But I'm going to work out in just a little bit, so I'll be putting my hair up for that. And I'll probably stay that way until we have something else important to do. <laughs> um, seven or eight. Favorite summer nail polish. And I have a whole bunch here. Pink is my favorite summer nail polish. But I have... Let me get them. All of these... And they're all, except for one, by the Maybelline Color Show, which is my favorite, uh, my favorite nail polishes that I have. And I will try to link a, um, I'll put a link below for Maybelline Color Show. Um, I have all their pinks, like literally all their pinks that they came out with this this year like just recently i've collected these over the past few months um there's three more and they're hit and miss with their colors uh well, not not their colors the colors are all beautiful it's the formula some of them can be really runny or you have to put a couple of layers on but they have these beautiful sparkles let me see okay they have these all these different beautiful glitters and this one is so pretty it's got gold flakes in it and pink flakes and silver and it is called gilded rose and it is amazing you can't really tell the lots kind of hitting it wrong on 
on here. Um, it looks really good over any pink. This one is called Pink Splatter, and it's part of their street art. I have two. No, no, no. This is a different one. So this is part of their street art, and it's just a very light pink and black like chunks and stuff, but it looks really good over a pink. Pink, I've got the uh, Pretty in Polka, which is part of their polka dots. This one is probably one of my favorite um, dots, if you have any kind of nail polish with dots in it. It's one of my favorite right there. And then this one is the Punk Rock Pink, and I put it over Hibiscus Haven. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll see it, but I'll go ahead and I'll insert a photo here. It looks coral. I don't maybe on camera it looks more pink in real in real life. In real life, because this isn't real life. Um at my house it looks to me it looks coral color, like a very light pink, but with a hint of curl like a corally pink, I guess. Both of them do, but these are two are very beautiful together. Um again I'll leave a link below for all that. And then the one that I picked up in my beauty haul, I'll leave my beauty haul below too. Um, the Miami Nice. I kept on saying Vice because, I don't know, I guess it just, but this, I had this on my toes. I'll also a link another, I'll post another picture. Okay, so yeah, that um, is by Essie, Miami Nice, and it is beautiful on my toes. I had it on my toes like a couple of days ago, but I hit something and I broke one of my toes, toenails like off. So we got a pedicure last night and I'll post a picture of that right here. <laughs> I'll just keep posting pictures. But um, yeah, she fixed it up real good for me. This one broke, but this is a really pretty color. This was a color club color that she had, um, which I thought was a really pretty pink. And um, I'll try to find it and I'll leave it below too. So this is look look below for stuff. Always look below. Okay. Enough about nail polish. I get really excited about nail polish. Um, number nine. Would you rather spend a summer day outside in the pool or inside watching Netflix? Netflix. Well, I don't have Netflix. I have Amazon Prime. But um, I'd rather to be out of the pool. We are we are outside people. My kids are outside people. We've been going to the splash pad. We've been going to the park with our friends. Um, there's a water park that's just a couple of miles away from my house. I mean, there is just so much to do. Um, we're gonna go down to the Wichita Falls Mountains, I think is what it is. It's in like Southern, it's like an hour away right here. I've never been there before, but I'm really excited. We're going to go do that. So we like camping, and me and my family are just huge outside outside people at all. And I will say this, too, is that, um, oh, and yeah, congratulations, Burke, on graduating high school. I should have said that in the beginning, or Courtney, Burks and Bees, Courtney. Um, I should have said that before I even started this video to congratulate you for graduating college or high school I hope you go off to college and do something great I mean you're so beautiful and there's so much but I um I saw that this is a lot of younger girls are doing this tag so I'm glad that I can kind of put my a little bit of an older twist to it you know with kids and stuff so yeah this tag is um it's really fun okay so 10 Sunglasses or hats. I love sunglasses. Um, 11, what is your song of the summer? And this one was really hard for me because usually when I'm riding in the car, I have my kids with me. So there, we have a DVD player. If you saw it in my vlogs and stuff, you'll see I have a DVD player in my car. And that's always going. So the only new song right now that's out that I really have in my head is that fancy song by Iggy Azel Azella. And, um... No, I'm so fancy. You already know. Yeah, I can't sing, but yeah, I love that song. I could just like, just snap to it and dance to it. I mean, the, it's so funny today. Like when I was younger, um, I'm going to get on a rant here real quick. When I was younger, uh, music had like meaning <laughs> and it was really deep. And then songs today, I don't even know the words to them, but if you can dance to it and it has a beat, it is the bomb. Because I don't even know what she's talking about in that song. 
So anyway, yeah, I really, really do like that song. Um, number 12, do you have a summer bucket li list? If so, share some of the things on the list. Um, my summer is usually just filled with making my kids happy. That That's it. That's my bucket list. It, if it's something that my kids want to do, um, then I'll do it. I know we're going to go to the zoo. We're going to go to the water park. Uh, probably play putt-putt golf somewhere because my husband's a big golfer and we, um, as a family, obviously we can't go with them. So, uh, yeah, just anything that has to do with making my kids happy. Camping, um, visiting family, that's our, our summer, our summer do, to do. Um, number 13, bikinis, tank bikinis, or a one piece. And I've got some bathing suits right here. Um, my favorite bathing suit bottoms are from Victoria's Secret. And they are this, uh, this top. Um, they fit me perfectly. Uh, they're just the right cut. They don't show too much. I have a couple of pairs of them. And, um, yeah, so I love those. And I, my black ones, I don't even have a top from Victoria's Secret to match it. This one is a Lost, I think is what it's called. Lost black tank. It's just black. And it's triangle. And then this one is from Victoria's Secret. It goes with the blue. And it's a triangle. It has lots of padding in it because I need all that padding. Um, so funny what I do when I get out of the water is it has so much padding in it. I've got to squeeze all the water out. And it's like just squeezing sponges. And it's just, it's hilarious. But there is also something that I wear with the black one. You know, if you're a mom, then some days you just don't have time to shave when you need to go to the pool or you're running out of the house you know the kids are like oh we gotta go and you're like oh my god i'm gonna be wearing a bikini so i have a little skirt for that i've had this skirt forever um I, it's made by sea angel i mean it's got all these pretty colors in it so i could practically wear it with whatever, whatever kind of top that i want it to but when i don't have time to take care of my bikini area i wear my little skirt and, um, yeah, so that saves me, um, whenever I go to the pool or to the beach. Um, so yeah, so to that question, it obviously was bikinis. Okay, just a couple more. There's only 15 questions to this. I'm kind of getting long-winded, but, um, anyway, number 14, must have summer makeup product. And it is the L'Oreal magic skin beautifier bb cream and i am in medium if you have never used this before it is um i have oily skin and it says it does four things it primes corrects hydrates and perfects and i think it's great it to me for me you know this is me personally it may be different on other people it does not sweat off um it's what I wear when I go to the the gym because I'm one of those girls who has to wear makeup when she goes to the gym. It's not a lot of makeup, but it's makeup. Um, yeah, it doesn't sweat off, and it's really good coverage. It's like a, you know, like a, I feel like it's like a medium coverage. It's supposed to be like a, a lot coverage, but you could also use it as a primer. I did that before where I put it under, um, under my foundation, and I think I used it with the Estee Lauder one of the Estee Lauder foundations. Um, but yeah, it works so great. But it comes out white. It has these little black beads in it, which you can't see. And then whenever you rub it in, it matches your skin. See? See there? But yeah, that is my, my must-have for the summer. Um, definitely my must-have makeup. And of course, some waterproof mascara, which I don't even have right now. I need to go pick up some. Um, and soon too. Uh, number 15. This is the last question. What is your favorite thing about summer? And my favorite thing about summer or spring even, um, and a little bit into fall, is just being able to go outside and enjoy. Whenever we were young, there was no computers or maybe there was computers. We just couldn't afford one. There was no iPads. There was no iPhones. There was no, you know, social media and all that. And it's not that I don't deny my kids that obviously because I'm on YouTube and all over the place. And you know, they do play games. My son has a DS, which is fine for like rainy days. Like today, today it is rainy outside. It is not pretty at all. So we went to church and then I'm going to the gym. So I'll take the kids there and they'll get to play for a little bit. 
But um, y'all would just love being outside. And I love to wear sandals and flip-flops. I hate shoes. I don't like tennis shoes at all. Tennis shoes are for the gym for me, and that is it. If I work out, that is the only time I wear tennis shoes. I have boots and stuff for the winter. But I, until I met my husband, I had the same pair of tennis shoes I tennis shoes I'd had since high school. And he's like, you have got to get some new tennis shoes to work out in. And I finally ended up getting some. And anyway, so two favorite things about being, or for the summer, is just being outside and sandals. So, um, yeah. But anyway, that is my tag video. Um, if you're watching this, I tag you. And I'm going to try to find a couple of girls. And I'm going to tag below. I don't know too many people on YouTube um, yet. So... I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to see more. Ipsy will be coming out soon. I'm so excited. I'll be getting my Ipsy box. And I'll be unboxing that. And just, oh, there's just so much to come. So, um, as always, I'll see you guys later. Bye.